Hello my dear students, welcome to Baiju's exam prep. Hope you guys are fine. So today we will be carrying out the analysis of BAC 2023. Let me tell you that this paper was held on 9th of April 2023 afternoon shift that is 3 to 5 p.m. session. So I'll be telling you the number of subjects, the number of topics and round about the number of questions which were asked from each of these topics. So let's be quick and carry out. So let's talk about it. So here you can know about me. You can join my telegram group for further upcoming updates. And let's talk about further. So the number of questions were 100 questions. Time allocated was 120 minutes. Total marks was 300. Three marks for one particular portion. That is each question. Every question were MCQs question. Negative marking was one for each wrong answer. Now coming to the analysis part, the overall analysis, so calculator was different from that of grade. Students were finding very much difficulty in using calculator that when it is going square, whenever you're adding. So yeah, you have to juggle up with the calculator for sure. If you talk about the level of paper, it was moderate to tough and it was time consuming. If you keep the time in mind, that is two hours. Students say that because of the time, you can count it to the tougher side because the many of the questions were quite lengthy and were so much calculative. So although they were knowing the answer or basically they were knowing how to solve the questions, they were not do because of shortage of time. Now coming off the questions, if you compare it as that of gate, still has asked for merely two marks, three marks. But here you won't believe they have asked questions like modular ratio, then you have to calculate strength, you have to calculate strength of welding, shape factor of hollow circular, and there were many more questions related to bolting and all. So that was something, and uh, you have portions of gantry girder, plate girders, that portions were also being asked. So here steel had an upper edge for bark examination as compared to that of gate. Now coming further, I'll be telling you the subject wise analysis, question paper analysis. Let me tell you the topics are for sure these topics only, but the number of questions one, two can be higher or lower. So this is based on the data which is provided by the students. So round about the number of questions has been this only. So if you talk about strength of materials, questions like bending, stress, deflection, questions were there. Geotech, you had many questions like soy shear failure, flow net questions, compaction, effective stress, consolidation. You have questions related to square footing and strip footing as well. So roundabout students are saying some 13 to 14 and some 14 to 15 questions. So I have taken to be an average that is 14 questions. Talking about environment, yeah, here the number of questions has been 7 to 8 uh, because questions like noise pollution, which has not been asked in your gate examination, it is not there in your syllabus. BOD, biochemical oxygen demand, that simple questions which I always used to tell you in the bar uh, whenever we used to practice, that simple questions like to calculate uh, remaining BOD, BOD ultimate was given, such question was asked. Then questions related to activated sludge process, septic tank, disposal of treated effluent and questions of Stokes law was asked. Coming to transportation, so in highway engineering, we have questions related to traffic signal, we have overtaking side distance, summit curve, these questions were asked. Talking about RCC, you have WSM, you have LSM, spacing of stirrups, equivalent moment, buckling of column. So these questions were asked in your RCC. Coming up next, structure analysis. Here you can see the number of questions have been much more as compared to that you have get. Similar goes with steel, similar goes with structure analysis. You have questions related to degree of static indeterminacy where students say that it was an easy question. Coming to influence light diagram, there was two questions of influence light diagram was also there. Steel, some questions were simple, but some questions were calculative as well. Eccentric bolted connections, shear stress of bolt, shape factor, plate girder, gantry girder. So round about 13 to 14 questions were there at that of steel. Coming up next, hydrology, we have two questions, evaporation and hydrograph. But one question was very much lengthy, so students have skipped that. Coming to irrigation, there was frequency of irrigation, field capacity, permanent building point, everything was given. And they asked you to calculate frequency of irrigation and one question related to dam was there. Building materials, if I talk about questions related to concrete and wood was there. Okay. Now, 
talking about engineering mathematics we have questions differential equation maxima matrix laplace so these questions were there regarding your engineering mathematics cpm part there was questions related to critical path where they have given you optimistic time pessimistic time most likely time and then you have to calculate it and then calculate the critical path so obviously this was a time consuming question then there was a question related to float value as well Coming up to survey, survey was like compass, leveling, leveling, traversing, sensitivity questions were there. So around about four to five questions was there of survey. Fluid mechanics, if I talk about, so here in fluid mechanics, I have included OCF also. OCF is also included here. So two questions were from OCF also. There was a question related to hum and there was a question related to, it was like, um, here somewhat energy head was given to you here uh, some value was given to you here it was given to you so some portions like this was there so here you have to apply total energy on both the sides so such questions were there adhesion cohesion theories and uh, critical energy questions yeah but uh, a hum question was something which was uh, you can say lengthy to solve so many students were not able to do because of shortage of time they marked it for review that they will do it later on but the time available to them was not enough so it was like question was simple but the calculation was lengthy because of that they have to skip the question okay so number of questions i have told you so these are the questions these are the questions which are there so you can have a look once again regarding to it every questions basically or from every topic has been told to you so these are the topics and you can see here that structure analysis and steel which we haven't given so much of importance in gate but yeah bark has asked a lot of questions on this okay so these were the topics and these were the number of questions which i have told you number of questions can be plus minus one or two because these are as per the students data which how much they remember they have recalled and they have given to us okay so i hope all the best to all the students who have given the bark examination all the best for your result and let me tell you well in advance that this paper when you qualify everybody whether you're getting 300 marks or whether you're getting a cut of marks everybody is same in the interview panel so be ready for the interview prepare for it and however i'll tell you one more thing generally when i ask the students the number of students have attempted portion round about to 40 45 so maximum so students when i'm talking about so when i ask them they're saying that 42 44 45 and they're like very much pretty confident that yeah we have attempted 42 portions and we are pretty much confident that at least 40 would have been correct so there might be chances that this year we could have a lower cutoff but uh, see i asked to some students so we can't uh, generalize it about it because last year the cutoff for civil was 143 okay so let's wait for it when the uh, this bark examination results will be there and then we'll discuss regarding it thank you so much guys and if you haven't subscribed to our channel do so thank you everyone